today i'm going to discuss the most important topic uh, of the english literature the aesthetic period part 2 in the previous video i have discussed the lots of questions um related to the aesthetic periods part and uh, um, which is the part 1 and now i'm going to discuss the part 2 the word aesthetic used by the kant in the critic of few reasons for the level of knowledge obtaining through sense perception the word aesthetic used by kant in the critic of few reasons for the level of knowledge of did it through sense perception immanuel kant devoted dash for the analysis of beauty critic of judgment immanuel kant devoted critic of judgment for analysis of beauty hegel establishment is hegel established an a organic beauty between beauty and art hegel established an organic between beauty and art according to the hegel beauty id the manifestations of absolute experience according to the hegel beauty id the manifestations of absolute experience what is the norm of aesthetics beauty what is the norm of aesthetics beauty identify the dialogue in which plato explains about the absolute beauty symposism identify the dialogue in which the plato explained about the absolute beauty symposism for plato beauty exists only at a level mm. only at a level plato beauty exists only at a level according to the plato beauty seems in the nature is only a shadow of ideal beauty according to the plato beauty seen in nature is only a shadow a ideal beauty who thinks art as the stepping stone to philosophy who thinks art as a stepping stone to philosophy hegel according to the kant beauty in the mankind is always the expression of morality so basically the aesthetic period is a period in which lots of uh, lots of writer creates a lots of beautiful works and there are some example of this work and lots of historical facts happening which influence the english literature and makes uh, lots of changes um, in uh, in the form of writing of uh, novel fictions poetry prose and etc so these are the most important changes and the aesthetic period is um, is it uh, totally um, describe the and related to the used by the kant in the critic of few reasons for the level of knowledge obtained through sense perception immanuel kant devoted dash for the analysis of beauty immanuel kant devoted critic of judgment for the analysis of beauty hegel establishment and a uh, organic be- between beauty and art according to the hegel beauty id the manifestation of absolute experience what is the norm of aesthetic is beauty identify the dialogue in which the plato explained about the absolute beauty symposism symposism for plato beauty exists only at a level at a level according to mm, 
according to the plato between seen in nature is only a shadow of the ideal beauty who thinks art as the stepping stone of philosophy hegel who thinks art as a stepping stone of philosophy hegel according to the kant beauty in the mankind is always the expression of morality so i hope you like this video which is very important according to examination point of views so keep your mind keep in your mind so all the points and all the question answer while you are attempting your exams thank you so much